Um, that's a little hard to do. A little hard. <laughs> Okay. Killing Shaw, and I'm, I'm just gonna leave it up to him if he wants to come back. So, this first screen, you can put mods into the game that are available on the Steam Workshop, but if you enable any of the mods, then you don't get to do your achievements. Oh, so this to keep people from cheesing their way through achievements. Yes. So, I'm not using mods for now, I'm still learning the game, trying to figure it out. And there are people making extremely complex, very detailed cities where they plan every little aspect of their town, but... <coughs> I'm I, sure you I'm can not, do better than them. <laughs> I'm not really doing that right now. But she will at some point. <laughs> <laughs> so, then I have to pick... Um, what map I want to use, and then it tells me the natural resources of each area, the connections to the outside world, how much suitable area for building there is, how much water. Yep. And then I just have to pick one based on what I plan to do with the city. So I'm going to go with the first one, and then I get to choose whether I'm going to have them go on the left or on the right when they're driving, you know, for those Europeans. Um, but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to keep it unchecked so that it's on the right side. And then I have to wait for it to load the map. I've noticed that unlike Sim City, this mm -hmm. isn't really laggy at all. Yeah, he said that in the review, didn't he? Mm-hmm. It might be because it might be this time because I haven't streaming, but when I was playing, I mean, I could zoom zoom in and see all the details and everything, and zoom out, go all the way across the screen. Everything was fine. There was no lag. You tab out. <clears throat> no. Be right back mode activated. It shouldn't oh, be. It's back on again. Oh. Maybe it's just happened for a second. I don't know. So I have. Oh, to look at the river! It polluted immediately. It's not polluted yet. <laughs> I oh. paused it. Um, it has the, the tutorial boxes are gonna pop up. But I already know what to do. Anyways, I'm going to okay. zoom out. All of this dotted line tells me where my city yes, is. Yes, you work for this company. It's like you're trying to sell the game to me. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> go, go. Oh, so that's your space to build in, that square? Yeah. Eventually I can buy more land and have it connect to this land. But... So it's the map randomly generated? Or is uh... it something you chose? No, this map always looks like this map. Can you start on a different map? I I can pick one <coughs> of the other ones that was on the loading screen. But there's no randomly generated map. No. I can download new ones, though. Oh, okay. Okay, so in order to start building, I have to look for the freeway exit. Mm-hmm. And start building off of this. The freeway exit is presumably next to the freeway at the bottom, right? Mm -hmm. I, yeah. I see it's got that pretzel-y shape. Mmm, pretzels. <laughs> and then, um... 
they're grayed out right now, but once I start building, uh, I'll have more road mo road options. I can build a straight road, a curved road. Oh, I thought you were going to say a gay road, a bi road. <laughs> a freeform road. And then I can upgrade my roads later on without having to rebuild them. But if you want to build a thicker road, like if I just do a two lane right now and eventually I want to do a six lane, then it's going to destroy anything that's in its path. Oh, wonderful. So you have to plan ahead for that. Or build your but, houses further away. Or have people get mad at you that you're destroying their house to build a freeway. And that would be just what Jess does. <laughs> it's like, fuck you, I want it here. Yeah. Oh, it just started, Tibbs, so you didn't miss too much. Oh, you missed everything. We were talking about uh, shit and things. And, no, I don't know. Whatever. So, w after I build my initial road, I have to build my water supply. Mm -hmm. And it will have to connect to this river. If you notice, none of my other p parts of my city connect to the water except for this section right here. Yeah, I see that. So, all of my <laughs> industrial stuff, I'm gonna. That's plan. where all the pollutants will run. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna put all my industrial stuff along the river. That's horrible, Jess. Well, right now my only option is that. Eventually I'll be able to build super efficient environmental cities, but... You will not be in business for long with this <laughs> MO. Tips called to be informative. Wah. Tips, don't make fun of me. I'm just trying to help. <laughs> so now that I actually started building, I have more options for roads. Do you always uh, put a road, a road around the perimeter like that? Yes. Do you have to? No. Okay. I'm you, just curious. You can build however you want. Like, there's a small roundabout that I can do right now. A small roundabout? Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Okay. And there's one-way roads, but I know how you feel about one-way roads. I would build a trans-dimensional jump city where all of the Elder Gods meet up and, well, the humans don't survive uh, and it's not very well populated. Oh, well, there's a six-lane road, which looks like that. Now I'm going to zoom in so you guys can actually see what these roads look like. Tibbs lives in, lives in Texas. He gave up the the ghost. We know where he lives now. Okay, so this is the six lane road right here. Oh, it's so big, Jess. But it's not the first time you heard that. Huh? <laughs> then here's the roundabout. Are you gonna? Are you building the city, or are you just showing me this? I'm showing you for now. Okay. Why you yell at me? <laughs> you know, it's it's really <laughs> interesting to have a six lane uh, road end at a tree. Did you see that? No, no, no. The six lane ends into the freeway. <laughs> no, no, no. Look at the other end of it. There's a tree there. It's just a lonely tree. The freeway ends into the tree. Yeah. And then if I decide that I screwed up, I can bulldoze it all. North California. Oh, man. As long as you drink Oregon beer, you'll be fine. He lives over by the grapes. The grapes? Yeah, right before Six Legs. He falls asleep in the wine fields and... So did it... No, it's putting trees back when you delete stuff. Perhaps. You have the game paused then, right? Uh, it is paused. Okay, so... I like to do my building while it's paused. Nothing is permanent until you unpause it. Nothing's right. really permanent because you can so always like, undelete. You can always you, delete it. You got rid of that uh, road, and a tree instantly popped up where it should have been. <laughs> it's magic. Oh, we're gonna be destroying more of the earth here. <gasps> Jess, I thought you were a druid. I am. You're destroying forests and polluting lakes. I'm only gonna okay. do a four lane this way. Oh. Oh, you can also build things at an angle, so I can have my 
three lane or my four lane. So was there a tutorial for all of this? Well, they, all these little pop-ups tell you how to do things. Oh, so yes. Yeah, but there's no like. Well, we're gonna practice first. It's uh, do as do do as you go along, I guess. <laughs> you sh did it. Did do 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 do. So you can build elevated roads, but I I don't have a need for that right now. Oh, that'd be awesome. Build an elevated road over a twenty-story tall building. Okay, so I'm <laughs> I'm gonna build a bridge here. You laughed at that. I did. Yes, you horrible person, Jess. But then the bridge is gonna immediately end as soon as it gets over here. I think he. he I hope the Lorax pops out of the trees and gets mad at you. No, no, no. I'm gonna I'm gonna delete this. I'm just showing you what the bridge looks like. I am the Lorax. I speak for the trees. Uh, do, you, do you see the bridge? Isn't this yes, fancy? Yes, mm -hmm. Look, let me zoom it, in. Ooh, I like the way the water bridge. looks. The water looks cool. Ooh. They've been mastering water for a while now in these graphics engines. Yes. Okay, so... All, Shaw says, all I see is bridge. <laughs> well, Je or well, Shaw, sorry. You're not Jess, but... I'm Well, Shaw, we're Can't demonstrating how what bridges look like. Jess has decided to describe every single thing in the game to me. I did. <laughs> Does that look right? I don't think that looks right. I'm gonna delete that. See, I spent a lot of time building things and then deleting them because I don't think they look right. <laughs> the uh, roundabouts look like you're putting crop circles out in your city. I know. Well, I later on I can do a three-way intersection. I That's would whistle chaotic. the um, X Files song to you, but I don't think I'd get it across too well. And although you don't see, oh, let me, although you don't see it, these are actually intersections with. They're supposed to have lights, but they don't. I don't know why. They look. They kind of have a stop sign, and that's it. Well. It doesn't matter. <laughs> <laughs> as long as it works, who cares? Yes. So I'm putting the four lanes around the edge because when I didn't do that before, there was a lot of traffic and congestion along this one little pathway right here because they all get off the freeway. And then when I only had a two lane road there, it was constant traffic because not only do you have people coming in that want to live here, but there's also tourists that come in, too. Shaw says, intersection, more like in her section, am I right? <laughs> Question mark. <laughs> oh, Shaw. Shaw's so funny. I know, he's such a prevert. He's yeah. almost as bad as Tibbs. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm, I'm kidding. Shaw's a way bigger pervert than any of us. I love you, Shaw. Yes, he is. I'm not a pervert. I don't have a scantily clad Harley Quinn on the wall. No, you uh, don't. Yeah, she's fully clothed. Just got it for me. She's amazing. Okay. <laughs> so, now. Okay, Topher, shut water. up. I will now continue the demonstration of how we build our master city. <laughs> uh huh. So. I'm not going to put the water that close to the street. Can you have the sewage empty out into the streets? <laughs> no. That'd be messed up. This is the sewage pipe, which I'm going to put down here. You have to at put the, it down At the end of the street? No, no, no. The, the, you'll see the sewage pipe in a second. What I put down first was the water pumping station. And you connected them with a the tube, which you thought was a good idea at the and time. That was the first time I did that. I'm not <laughs> doing that now. Um, but you have to put the water pumping station in first to get the water... So you don't want all the sewage and it has to be going up, downstream to your water pipe. It has to be pipe. upstream. Yeah. And then the pipe has to be downstream. Otherwise Which makes people sense. get sick and die. Also, you'll well, notice welcome a little to plague city. You'll notice a little Tweety bird up here. He tells me people's tweets. Tweets. Oh, right. The imaginary people that aren't that it's supposed to be the people that live in your city, but okay. 
So since I'm building water now, I need to build some pipes going from the water. And they oh, go it's under, it. they go under Jim, the you're a super freak, man. We know. We know. <laughs> Actually, I'm not sure I know everything, but it's okay. We'll find out later. Find out later. I know everything about Shaw, though. Everything. Everything. Right, everything. You know everything about Shaw. I know everything about Shaw there is to know. So we're not going to connect the two pipes this time. Woohoo! So now I sort of have a sort of a triangle that's filled with water. All Are you building uh, Illuminati sy symbols here or something? <laughs> All of the blue area is what has water access. Oh, okay. Now so we're going to build it. If you were to build houses and stuff there, it'd automatically have it. Yes. <clears throat> so to get houses further in, you'd have to build more pipes inside that white area. Uh, yeah, I can just connect these, like... I am learning something. Like, right there. It's connected. But I'm not going to fully do it right now, because I have to watch how much money I spend. So now we're going to do the electricity, which um, we have two options right now. A small wind turbine, like the one in Palm Springs. Uh-huh. Or the coal power plant, which does more. Now, but, but it uh, pollutes a lot. So let me ask, let me ask you a people. question, okay, Jessica? Yes. Let's say that you are really indeed the mayor of this town, and you live in a place that's kind of warm, like California. Would you build a two-story tall building and then point the windmill at your office? So no. that it's constantly blowing air at you. They, we don't normally <laughs> build buildings up because of the earthquakes. We build them out. Hmm. The only ones that go up usually are the hospitals. Would Al you? Although in LA, is so there's the skyscrapers there because of companies and EPs and stuff. I'm surprised there's anything in LA personally. I like the amusement parks though. <laughs> <laughs> so since this pollutes a lot, if I put one near where my houses are gonna be, then they complain. Shaw, you've heard, or Jess, you've heard that No Effects song, right? Get out of my way, can't you see I'm from East Bay? <laughs> no. Ole, ole. So I have to put one of these um, poles, power lines, inside the power green or blue area. But when I put it down, it takes away what these squares where I can build things. So I have to be kind of careful. So do you have to build in all those little black squares? Is that showing you where you can build? Where I can build, yeah. Okay, I so that makes that. sense. What now? Why would you? Okay, you're so you're trying to connect that to the other thing. <laughs> yeah, to get power. I can't do it that. And way. it just it just has to be close, right? This is the most messed up looking system ever, Jess. <laughs> this look like woman built it, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> okay. Apparently your street lamps don't need any power. <laughs> no, well, I think they're solar. Solar? Yeah, the ones here are. What magic city is this? They, they collect energy from the sun during the day and then they use it to power the lights at night. Fantastic. Amazing. I know. Science! Yep. Okay, so this is too close to the exit. I like uh, that the uh, wires aren't, like, strictly straight and angular. They're kind of curvy and stuff. Kind of curvy? Yes, Tibbs. Magical female city. We're all... all we're all things lead to nowhere. <laughs> <laughs> You guys want to fight, huh? <laughs> no, not you guys. Uh -huh. I got your back. You can fight with me, though. I'm not going to fight with well, you today. Just, just put the pole down. Come on, man. Are you going to bypass you gonna bypass the trees? Yeah. Okay, everything's connected now. I'm almost out of money. 
God, why why did you put that big old thing going that way? Because I couldn't put it any along the thing because it's too close to the edge of the city. Okay, but why did you feel the need to connect that? Because wasn't it connected to the other side? It, no, it has to it has to make a full loop. Oh, it does. Yeah. Okay. See, I didn't. I don't remember it that. It doesn't part. have to connect to the one that's right here next to the power plant, but it does have to make a full loop to something. So now I have to set some zones, like uh, yellow is the industrial zone, so. And red is residential, blue is commercial. No. Oh my God! I thought they directly rip it off from SimCity, but I guess not. <clears throat> so I'm going to put for right now my industrial right here. And then I'm going to build a little road right here. Just so, so I can separate them. Is your industrial automatically that size or can you drag it? No, you can make it, it, it it has different options. It has the fill or you can do um, a small brush or a marquee or large brush. So you can figure out how much exactly you want to do. You can be exact with it too, like um, one square industrial and then the next. This kind of game is made for people like you and Shaw. Organization? I don't know, crazy logistical like, I plan this to work exactly like this and it does it. <laughs> <laughs> well made plan. But then when I hate everything, I'm like, I gotta start over. Okay. Okay, so then blue, or this light blue, is low density commercial. I don't okay. get any of the apartments or offices or any of that stuff yet. Right now, I just get the industrial Apartments zone. are counted as commercial, huh? No. I, I mean, those are considered high-density residential. So you're just filling these spaces right now, right? Yeah, because I don't really care. Are you intentionally making an Atari symbol, or is that not intentional? <laughs> you noticed. <laughs> you didn't do that on purpose, <laughs> you liar. <laughs> um, if I were trying to make the most perfect city ever, I would pay more attention to it how much I was putting into each of these things. There'd be at least one huge penis in here somewhere. But right now I'm just... I'm still Making learning. Atari symbols. <laughs> I'm right. still learning everything, so... I would like to get a high population without everybody dying first. <laughs> I bet they'll patch that. Because it does seem a little unwieldy. Okay. What's, what's wrong with those areas near the tree down there? Are those not filling in properly? Well, when you put the power lines down, it takes away some of your squares. So... Oh, I can go up one more. There we go. And the thing is, is that if I were completely OCD, I'd be like, these squares don't line up? Someone out there is that OCD. Look, I would love to see their squares. city. When I build a diagonal line, the squares don't line up with the other squares. You okay. sound way too convincing. <laughs> <laughs> I believe you completely when you say this to me. Oh no, I built a road. And it ruined my squares. I gotta do it again. <laughs> do you have enough water connecting all these things? <laughs> For now. When Are I you start, sure? Yes. When I start getting more people, I have to build more. Wait, I don't think they're all connected by water. They are. You'll see when I unpause it. Oh, God. These are... Oh, I ran out of money. Yes, you ran out of money. Yeah, I have to unpause it and make some money. Let me fill these in some more. So what? right now... These are some I, weird looking streets. <laughs> I don't have any sort of... I have no trash pickup, no health care, no fire, no police, no education, the no transportation, no parks, nothing. All I have right now is zones and some streets. 
I'm ready to see stuff get built. Okay, so now I'm going to unpause it. <laughs> Smack the space bar <laughs> as hard as you can. Are you guys going to build? Where are you building first? Ooh, you're building houses over here. Ooh, ooh, let's see. <laughs> it's exciting stuff. This is like SimCity, man. <laughs> the best thing ever. Oh, look at the... My God, they're building fast. Just got to it. It's like magic. Magic. Oh, I can speed it up, too. Or I can make uh, uh, it go slow. And then, you can have multiple households in houses, just like, um... Real life. Yes, Shaw. Road Simulator 2015. So, there's different kinds of houses. I don't get to decide what kind of houses Look at how here. cool the houses are. They're all retro, old houses. My favorite. Okay, so here's some duplexes, and then there's some regular one, one singular family house. I would whatever. totally make a This is Sparta joke, but... Then here's some townhouses <laughs> over here. Oh, these guys need water. I, that's what I... That's what I said to you. Are you sure that's covered by water? And you're like, oh, Rrr. I forgot this little area. Oh, I don't have money for that. Let's see if I can take out a loan. I can't take out any loans yet. Okay. Right. So they built their house on places without water. Well, that's why the oh, rent is so yeah, cheap. Yeah, I should I should unzone that. You guys need to move out. There's no water here. Get out of here. Get. Well, Tibbs, if you'd like to see a full review. <laughs> I, I'm here to play a Justice Secretary. Look, they're leaving. No! They found out there's no water there where they were told there is no water. I, I just told them to leave, and they're all upset now. Wait, why are you still here? Didn't just, I tell you to leave? I'm gonna link into your stream. Okay. There. Wait, wait. I can't do it. I have to log in. Oh, fuck you. Log oh, in? Yeah. Really? What is my username? How about this well, it's, one? It's, uh, isn't it Lappenstein? I think it's Lappenstein TV. You guys don't have power? There. It There's a link you to have it. Have power. Be. LGR reviews are awesome. Hmm. It should have linked. I don't know. It just said welcome to the chat room now. It's Why behind. are you saying you don't have power? Oh, I see. Well, I don't have any money to fix that. Jess, this is the best experience you've ever had as a mayor of a city. I know. You don't even know. We'll have homes in the grass with nothing. <laughs> I say you leave. Why are you guys not leaving? Is it unpaused? Yeah. Maybe they just don't care. They're like, you know, we have an outhouse and we fetch our water from the polluted river. Nothing industrial is being built. Okay, you know what this means. We start over. <laughs> okay. Do I, I sound thrilled? It's not saying that you're saying anything in the chat. I only see Tibbs and Shaw. <sighs> there we go. There's the link to the review. I like LGR reviews. I trust him. Yeah, but if they watch the video, then they don't get to hear me talk. They won't get to watch my stream. <laughs> well, I mean, just save it for later then, I guess. <laughs> For a more in-depth review from a total sim file. <laughs> Someone with more experience with games. I don't know if he's ex more experienced. He's just way into it. Okay, I will do it faster this time. Oh, my sister commented on my Facebook profile. No doubt to gloat about her victory. Oh, she's not bragging about her victory. What is she talking about then? Oh, I I posted on Facebook that I was kind of depressed about the, th the other thing I had to do today. 
And by the it's over, and I was looking forward to getting past it. Oh. You know what I'm talking about. Oh, yeah. That stuff. Mm hmm Fine, uh -huh. you guys will all get water. All of you! I won't build so far up this time. <sighs> my uncles are favoriting my Dead of Winter pictures. They don't play these games. Why don't they tell me this shit? Okay. Maybe we have a good time. Everybody is now covered with water. <laughs> ah, the city of Atlantis. <laughs> Everyone is covered with water. Now electricity. Um, we just lost Shaw. He, uh... Well, he stole the stream, I think, but he read an announcement about new Banjo-Kazooie game, so he is now masturbating himself into a coma. <laughs> so he'll be awake when it finally arrives, and he doesn't have to put up with all the bullshit that comes between now and then. Great. What'd you do, Tover? What did you do? I did not announce anything about Banjo-Kazooie. Oh god, it's a rail shooter? What? I don't know what this means and I don't care. Rail shooter means that... <sighs> Basically... You're on... You're on the... Imagine you were in a Amtrak train heading down the tra train track, Jess. And you had someone behind you that had your head firmly planted in their hands and he was forcing you to look in different directions and you could shoot things with your eyes. But you can't stop the train from moving, you have no control over where you're looking, uh, but you get to shoot shit that you see with your eyes. That's a rail shooter. It is the worst kind of game. <laughs> this sounds terrible. Who comes up with these things? What? what? Let me do it. Fine. Okay, so everybody should have power this time, too. Shaw says he's offended. He's offended by what they did to Banjo, not by what I was saying. Oh, okay. Well, I don't know. I don't know what you're doing to him. It's um, it's basically like this, Jess. Banjo Kazooie is extremely loved, but he was plat he was a three D platform to begin with. So to put him on a rail shooter or a game where he builds shit and then races it and goes to quest hubs and crap is like a slap in the face because <laughs> it's not what he was originally about. It's like everything they've done to Sega or to Sonic since uh, Sonic Adventure. Although Sonic Adventure 1 and 2 were good. After that, it was a complete crapshoot. Okay. So you don't like Sonic Pinball? I have never played Sonic Pinball. <gasps> Just to be perfectly honest, I've never liked Sonic. The only time I've ever liked Sonic is in Sonic 1 and 2. I didn't like him when he was on the Genesis. I'm... <laughs> The only thing I liked about Sonic 2 was that Tails was in it, and I thought it was a girl. <laughs> I was a weird kid. I'm, uh -huh. still, I'm a weird man, too. You're still ah! weird. Okay. Well, that's good. Those were always weird. Okay. They, they shouldn't be whining about water and power this time. I mean, they might still do it. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, needless to say, Shaw, this is why I don't give a fuck about console gaming anymore. <laughs> okay, where are you guys gonna build now? Don't don't shoot yourself, Shaw. Just become a programmer and gain <laughs> influence over these things.
They're building. Excellent. I, I, I like the way the city looks already. It's just kind of interesting. Are you guys going to build any industrial? No. Hmm. I guess we're just building houses right now first. And I like that the houses are pretty detailed. It kind of reminds me when the people make this big huge table and then build a little model on it. You get real close. Yeah. That's what this looks like. This is please you. Yes. I like that there's so many different houses too. Nothing's the same. Shaw, why why complain about Banjo Kazooie when you get mad at the fact that there hasn't been a good Star Fox rail shooter in forever? <laughs> the very thing he was created for and best at has not happened again ever. Since these ones all along the edge are only one square, they make these tiny little houses for them. So shacks. Yeah, but not. Oh, all look at that! Look at that aquamarine green one. Some of them have satellite dishes, and some of them don't. Shaw's telling me I don't get it. I have the, no idea. This what one over here has a doghouse and a little patio set outside. There's cars whizzing by on the freeway. I see them in the background. Cars? Why you no come here? Oh, Shaw. Oh, look, the lights are here. We have traffic lights. <gasps> Amaze balls! I like the building animation. It's interesting and pleasing. The trees gently sway <gasps> back and forth. Bushes pop up out of nowhere. That's always pleasing. Oh look, we got some retail stuff. They just put two fast food places right next to each other. Yeah, Shaw. No, none of them outright terrible, but none of them near as close as, near as good as the originals, which I consider to be Star Fox and Super Nintendo and Star Fox 64 because 64 was actually good. Now, when you have the retail space and there's That's like that with modern technology. I'm sorry, Jess. They have plenty of space right here. Then they'll build a parking lot either in the front or in the back. They'll pave paradise and put up a parking lot? Mm-hmm. <gasps> this parking lot even has handicap spaces. And uh, so all the gimp-ass Swedes can park there, right, Joe? No. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Since I don't want two fast food places next to each other, I removed one. I don't know what else they're gonna build though. Let's see. Oh, there's some cars. What's this place? Oh, a cafe. You sold that place? Why'd you sell it again? Because it was right next to another fast food place with the same name. You don't like that? No. Uh -oh. Jess, you are quite the micromanager. <laughs> this is a general store right here. And this is another general store with a parking lot. They sell ice cream. I like how oldie time they look. It pleases me. We're gonna go visit over here in the rest of the retail section. Lots of family minivans on your streets. What is this place? Oh, this is industrial. This place is making clothes. Another place make oh this place is making ice cubes. And this is another ice cube factory. I still need to get Star Fox Command just because it's cheap now. But no, I'm not. I shouldn't talk to you guys about console games because I am not a console gamer. I have dabbled it in the past, but it's some distant memory for me. Here's a three story house. With a carport. And they have a roof deck. Wow, that's a big house. A roof deck. 
-hmm. You're just making words up now. No. -uh. <laughs> Look at it. Look at it coming together. It's so cool. These guys copied them over here. See the cars? Pause. It tells you what kind of car it is, who owns it, their education level, where they live, where they work. And it tells you what they're doing. He's driving home. <laughs> His home. Out in the wild. He just he gets off the uh highway and starts driving through the grass. <laughs> Pause. No, unfortunately, I didn't own any consoles until I owned a Nintendo. So I knew a person that owned an Atari though when I was a kid. These we bars Star in Wars here on it. tell you what the demands are. Like right now, there's a low need for residential. There's no need for commercial, but there's some need for industrial. I don't know why it says there's some need because if we look at it. There's all this space that they haven't built in yet. Maybe they're planning for more people to come. Oh, well, maybe it's that they can't build more until the population rises in your residential area. Maybe. So they need to create jobs for people and stuff. Yeah. Sometimes um, there'll be a little symbol over here telling me that they don't have enough educated workers or over here in the factory it'll say too many educated workers so basically it's like workers dumb and then you go over there workers smart <laughs> <laughs> yeah so here's the water when it's flowing that looks disgusting <laughs> and then here's the sewage pipe It doesn't look like it's having much of an effect on the water yet. But gross. Yes. My favorite games of all time are programmed by a developer named Benson. Look at how fast I can zoom through here. Hobart Star, whatever his name is. Oh man, he is so good. He is like a Java king. He writes script like a goddamn felon. He's so good. Calm down, Tover. I I know. I can't help it. Bimson is a rock star in the video game world. I'm sure you know of him. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> don't read Shaw's comments. <laughs> Shut up, Tover. <laughs> Look, there's some parked cars. Shaw, Shaw, you know what Shaw is thinking right now? He's like, if I, if you were here right now, Tofer, I, you are such a good friend, I would stab you in the neck and then snap your fucking neck at the same time. <laughs> that sounds violent. Because you don't know what you're talking about. I'm sure Bimson has some real programming chops, Shaw. I'm kidding. Kidding. <laughs> Look, there's people walking on the street. Awesome. I like that you have a little container place there. That's cool. Truck containers and the factories. Where's the power plant? Power plant? Mm-hmm. Reminds me of that um, power plant song on the Bionic Commander Rearm soundtrack. Really what good do they one. need for a residential? But what? We have residential. They're filling it up too fast? No, they're still filling it. Well then, tell them, shut up. Congratulations, reached 500. Yes. Now I Jessica's can plans to notes. take over a square of land in this world has come to fruition. I can have garbage, healthcare, and education services. I get a school, a clinic, and a landfill. What are you going to go for first? Trash. Yeah, I good to, choice. I had to pause this. Menopause. 
Topher was Sh no funny. Shut up, Topher. God, I get so, that a lot. It has to be built on a street. Or against Those? a street. The garbage place? Because uh, they need to send their trucks out, right? Yeah. So, I need to find a good uh, street to do this on. So, I'm going to build one. Maybe. This makes me want to get this game, Jess. When are you going to buy it for me? I'll build a huge pentagram uh, s series of streets <laughs> filled with roundabouts oh and God. residential areas. Yes. Yes. Why are you trying to make me angry with you, Topher? Why? What does that make you angry for? Roundabouts. What's wrong with roundabouts? I hate roundabouts. I hate them too. I had to drive through a whole bunch of them when I went to the zoo. I remember I was there. Yes, and that was stupidest thing ever. More we'll, stupider. We'll just have it dead end right here since it doesn't want to connect. <laughs> it's not connected, game. Let's try this again. Nervous laugh. <sighs> They arrive in relatively the same area. They look like they were connected, kinda. I don't know. I don't know anything. That is really weird, that intersection. Your power plant's in the way, you better bulldoze it. I will not do such a thing. Okay. What if I can make this go out just a little bit further? Ah. <laughs> that raised up the land. That could be a good thing, right? Kind of. Okay, we'll have a little curve going on there. I don't care. It's industrial. This is not my serious CD anyway. This is my alt. Okay. Oh yeah, that that looks good now that you fixed it. Garbage. You go... I don't know if I understand how it would work, but it's cool. I've never been on a road that leads from a four-way into a two-way like that, in that kind of a way. I don't think it would be fun, because you're, you'd be stopping right here, and then you have to go all the way up this little hill. <laughs> Is that the landfill? Yes. You put the landfill right next to the power plant. Yes. Huh. Is there pollution in this game? Like, does yes. it show you, like, SimCity, like, all the shit you th shit throwing up in the air? Uh, they're gonna compl they complain about it. See, this place right here says not enough workers. Well, I can't make people work for you, dude. Okay, now I have trash taken care of. We here at Piss Drinkers need more employees to take pictures of people being peed on. The trash will take care of the entire city, but it's going to eventually get full. If and the way you do bury it? No, the, eventually you can buy an incinerator. Oh, cool. But that's later on. So at one point I had two landfills going on. If all, this, all this game needs is a research track. That'd be amazing. <laughs> so, I'm gonna see where I want to put a medical clinic. It's not a hospital, it's a small clinic. I think you should put the clinic so, right next to Sean Lintu's house. It'd be banging like rabbits, babies every goddamn week. Oh, jeez. Yes. Little swatch, little swatch babies. Swatch babies? Yes, swatch babies. And now I have a medical clinic, and it highlights as purple, and then it highlights green all of the roads that it reaches. So, so if any shit goes down, everybody right it. now is covered by this medical clinic. Cool. When I start the schools, on the other hand, the schools have a much smaller radius, so I have to build like a whole crap load of them. So. I don't have money right now for a school, so we're just gonna... Just drop it next to the neighborhood, I imagine. Yeah, I built the medical clinic sort of in the middle so it'll reach everyone, but... There's also a problem with buildings catching on fire. 
And like he talks about in the review, there's abandoned buildings, and then if there's one abandoned building, suddenly there'll be a bunch of them, and people complaining about abandoned buildings, and... Are those water towers on the other side of the street for the industrial zone? I don't, I don't know what those are. No, these are fa part of a factory. What? These are storage bins. That they're they, silos or something? Yeah. These ones right here, these red ones, belong to the Goods Unlimited place. These blue ones belong to the box factory. Just admit it, the micromanager in you just go, gets giddy playing this game, doesn't it? <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm not micromanaging completely. But like I wish I was? <laughs> no. <laughs> See, like, this corner shop is crooked. <gasps> Son of a bitch! But I'm not doing anything about it. Here's a burger place next oh, to a it's... burger place. Well, they're in competition. You've got uh, Carl's Jr. and In-N-Out. Right next to each other. Yes. I would find it difficult to choose which one, but Look, I'd probably choose In-N-Out. Burgers! The hot I know. This, just showed this up is like left. Shaw's fantasy come to life. And next door to my favorite burger place is my second favorite burger place. <laughs> and look. <laughs> the, <laughs> that was hilarious when the hot dog truck showed up. He's like, oh, I'm out of here. <laughs> <laughs> he pulled in, sort of, and then left. <laughs> you got the one with more parking. Nobody's going there. Hear that or all the asshole customers are parking the other place. <laughs> and this place has another burger sign. And then there's another burger place. It's all burgers right here in this corner. Vacation. I go on vacation week after this one. And oh, I will be spending most here. of my time looking for empl or a different job. So <laughs> it'll, it'll be fun and scary and fucking shitty. This gas That's station cool. has no place to pay at. I like all those uniform houses in that row. That's almost creepy. There's a killer in there somewhere. Well, because these are all one squares. So all of them have to build the same exact tiny house, except they built, they did it different colors and stuff. It's, it's kind of cool at the same time, though. Look at all these people. Look at how Not much backyard workers. space they have. Oh, I have a high need for residential. I guess I should build some more. A woman, your titty, your your titty, your city is exploding. <laughs> what? I am tired. That I don't know where that came from. Your titties. <laughs> They're very nice, but we're not supposed to be talking about them right now. Jeez, Tover, jeez. You guys oh, saw that nanny down. moose. I know Jess saw, but you guys saw that nanny moose comment, right? Where he, she's like, you can grab my tits wherever you want, whenever you want. And then he's like grabbing them in public. She's like, I know I forgot it. I'm going to link it. Because I know I have it still. Shit cracks me up. Mm -hmm. He's I trying know. to distract you from what he said. See, now when I built this road right next to this house, these people got angry. Because of all the construction going on. <sighs> I built the road one square too long. Tits are serious business. Aren't they? Titty City, join us in your local porn emporium. Or news flash, Titty City. I don't have any more money to build more, so we'll have to deal with these for right now. Your minions are making you enough dough. Well, actually, I think I can take a loan now, so I'll probably I'll do that. Take a loan. Mm hmm. Build a school here. Oh, 
those people are so happy now that there's a school. It's only an elementary school, though. The mayor supports education. Yay! She doesn't want us crushing oranges against our heads to squeeze it for juice. Now I have to look to see if everybody has water. They they don't. I will extend this. What about power? Everybody have power? No. Where is the wow? The power lines are way over there. What did I do? Power lines right next to the school. Oh look, another test on Facebook. How much common sense do you have? None. You look at another shit when I'm streaming. You have no common sense at all. That's right. I know, I know that's why you said that. You're in trouble. Can't believe you. How dare you. Peanuts don't grow on trees. That's the first question. Peanuts are root plants, aren't they? I don't know. I'm playing City Skylines right now. Oh, I can tell you're mad at me now because of the way you said that. <laughs> <laughs> I say you, you're in trouble. Oh, look, we have some abandoned buildings here. We have to bulldoze them. If they go for a long time without enough workers, the company will leave and abandon like, the building. <laughs> when they leave, do you hear a little sound that says, FINE! No. <laughs> it does show me that money is gone, though. It'll put a little money symbol with a red circle over it, telling me that I just lost money because they left. to sit around and wait. I can choose how much money I want to give to all these things for the budget. It's pretty detailed. But right now I'm not going to adjust that. Yay! I got a thousand people! Now I can do a bunch more stuff. <laughs> Put a fire station in. Yay! Wonderful. And Topher's just gonna sit there and do his quiz. <laughs> <laughs> I know it. Okay, according to this, I have perfect common sense, a hundred percent. Interesting. Not sure if believe. Who are you to deny my greatness? <clears throat> so I can start enforcing some policies. 
but right now the only three that it gives me is are are ones that will cost me money. So I'm not going to put those into place yet. But um usually the first one I go with is the smoking ban. Smoking ban? Mm-hmm. Wow. You can do that, huh? What are you, a communist? Well, if you looked at the screen, you would see it on the policies page. Why would you ban smoking? It, each policy gives you pros and cons. The con of that must be that people can't smoke. Okay, so what is the little bar filling up in the bottom left-hand corner? Which one? In the bottom left-hand corner, it's a bar that keeps filling up over and over again. That's time. Oh, okay. Is, are those days? Yeah. Months? Hours? What does Olivia it say, Silver? Says, I can't read it, Jess. I had bad eyesight, and... It's the days. Okay. I have to get really close to my screen. My sister's bitching at me today to get new glasses. I'm I like, told you. I'm like, you guys secretly planned this shit about harping on me. I know it. Nope. Jess, I think you're too influenced by uh, SimCity. You built all of your industrial way far away from your residential. Well, in the other game that I was doing last night, I built a power plant not too far away from the houses. Look at how fast this things are building. Constantly complaining about smog. Constantly. But who doesn't want to have their own dragon in the city? I had it on the fastest speed. That's why they were building so fast. Ignore my hobbit joke at your own peril, woman. <laughs> What's the hobbit? Ah, oh, you... They have, um, at Costco, they had these really cool, they had the entire Fellowship of the Ring set and these small, tiny leather books. They're like hand books. I was so tempted. It's like 30 bucks for all four books. I wanted it really bad. I still regret not picking them up. Well, you can always go back. You think maybe I should? I don't know. 30 bucks is kind of expensive. It is kind of expensive. Although, if I'm getting 200, I'll have a little bit of wiggle room. It's over. Mm hmm. Yes. But it's. It, but they're books I want to read, though. Get them Amazon. On the Kindle. What? Get them on the Kindle. I want to upgrade my Kindle, too, though. And you were saying you want my old one. <laughs> I, I was saying I want to move in with you. I know. So anyways, I built a firehouse and a police station. We're kind of up in the air anyway with that since it's because of the job situation. <clears throat> if I wanted to, I could build the Statue of Liberty, but she's super expensive. Yeah. I thought that was worth getting the deluxe for. I was like, Jess will like that she can build landmarks. Build the uh, Eiffel Tower. I have a lot of money. Build the Eiffel Tower in the river. <laughs> so you French. can make. Yeah, so it can make a, uh, a bar like a barrier reef or whatever. <laughs> so the police station covers almost all of the town except for this one stretch of the industrial area. This is where all the criminals hang out. <laughs> Same thing with the fire department. They're like, for some reason, the cops just never make it over here. I could build a fire department right here, but I don't have the money for it. Eventually, I'll make sure that the industrial area has their own fire department. Because as you can see, there's a fire going on here right now. But they made it here in time and put it out. Oh, okay, so... It... Oh, here's another fire. I slowed it down this time. 
It, so it's just because just because they're out of range doesn't mean they won't make it there eventually. So that's good. Sometimes they won't make it there because of traffic. I remember in SimCity, like, if you were out of range, you were fucked. Because your, your fire de department guys were like, well, there's no way in hell we'll make it over there. Yeah, sometimes they don't make it in time. See, at this fire, the police and three in fire engines showed up. Yeah, I saw that the police pulled a U-turn at some point. <laughs> and there's a fourth one. They're all coming to help with this industrial fire. Ooh, it's spreading to another building. Oh, I see that. Well, they're all right there, so I imagine it'll be fine. Fuck, four trucks? Damn. That's an industrial fire. It's pretty big. Your dudes are all over it, though. Well, they got it out here, but now they have to get back in their trucks and go next door. <laughs> no, you're leaving? Come uh, back! How amazing. They'll go all the way back around come back to that. This is so on fire. <laughs> uh, fireman, you can't do it through the other building. I guess he's doing it anyways. He pulled his hose from that oh. truck all the way through the building to get to the one that's on fire. Yeah, I know. It's awesome. I'm getting to watch it. I think it's kind of funny. <laughs> <laughs> he's getting it, though. Good fireman. He got I, it. You, you gotta understand the last Sims I or Sim City I ever played was fucking one. <laughs> I I would never play two thousand even though I wanted to, and I have four, <laughs> but it doesn't run too well on Windows eight, so fuck it, I don't care. I'd just rather get a new game. Yay, good job guys. I like how the one that burned down first looks like it's brand new again. Well, they so, cleaned it up in the oh, time the, it took them to get did, the other fire Why out. did the hot dog truck just disappear into that building? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I saw that too. I don't know what it's doing. He's like, well, I'm going to take a turn in this transdimensional loophole here. And <laughs> <laughs> well, there's shit. another fire that this fireman's leaving. Oh, we're in high demand for residential again. I have to build. Is that fire in the trees? Uh, I can't look at it right now. You're just gonna let them take care of it, huh? It's paused. No fire is happening at the moment. Everyone's fine. Oh, I'm going to be thinking about that hot dog truck that took a turn to forever. I think people are going to get angry with how many intersections there are. It takes me an hour to get to work! <laughs> <laughs> okay. Let's, here's the fire that he's going to. It's at the burger place, or next to the burger place. Oh, that's obviously sabotage. It's next door. Someone, uh, stole someone else's burger recipe. <laughs> hey, you put meat in your burgers, we put meat in our burgers! <laughs> <laughs> and then the dissonance begins. He got it out. Looks like it's the steakhouse next door to the burger places. It's supposed to be a general store. Oh, wait, I didn't build any pipes for that new place. Yeah. They're complaining. I can see it in the distance. Water! Fucking water! Oh. <laughs> I don't know why they want water so bad. Can you build a hobbit hole? area, a hub, whole complex. I don't know what this means. Oh. I'm gonna it's... go with no. Shaw's making a joke. He says, mmm, toast. He saw all of your buildings on fire a little while ago. 1,500 people! Woohoo! Now I can build a high school and some parks. And they give you money each time you, uh, ding. Ding. <laughs> ding, woman. Yep. 
Yes, Shaw, your toast is a joke to me. What are you going to do about it? <laughs> he was he was not happy when I made toast earlier either. Why? You. I'm like, oh, me? Well, I think you toast people take it too far. You said... I want to make something better than toast. <laughs> like, I did, I did say that. What's wrong with toast? You still sound like the toaster uh -oh. off of Red Dwarf. We got another fire going on in that building again. Oh, two fires! Maybe you should build another fire department. I guess they're gonna get their own fire department over here. There we go. Although, although your fire guys are on top of it, I must say. Well, there's three of them at this building. And one at the other. And now that there's a second building, there's more over at the other one, but before it was only one. <laughs> oh, it's charcoal. Are you gonna go hold your bread up to that building fire on a stick, <laughs> Jess, and make some toast? No. Are you sure? I'm sure. <laughs> They're like, just ignore her. She's the mayor. She can do what she wants. Hey, those fire trucks just turned into the fire truck. I don't think that's that was pretty interesting happen. to see a house burning down on a riverfront. Well, oh, look at that! Yeah, ethereal. Oh, the <clears throat> donut. The donut truck is the most important part of that concession. He's like, hello guys, you put out fires, and he like follows them back with boxes of donuts. The police are extremely <laughs> jealous. <laughs> this is correct. Well, that's strange. Why does it stretch it to that other point? Look at these weird lines. I have to fix this now. Uh oh. Here comes Jessica's OCD. I think they're fine. They look like the streets of London. You should just leave them. This is not London. <laughs> Fuck the Europeans! Do you hear her, guys? Do you hear her? I know it sounded like my voice, but it was her. <laughs> okay, that's better. Apparently they want some more industrial areas, so I'm giving them some. They haven't had enough fires. Not enough fires. Yes. Fine. There you go. Oh, they want some of this, too. They want more industrial now that you have a fire uh, engine place there. Fire department. Perhaps. Perhaps. That would make sense. Okay. Everybody has water now, right? Yeah, okay. We got power. Okay. Everybody's fine. Policies. No Swedish people. Um, smoking. It's gonna be like Family Guy policies. <laughs> no Jews and no blacks. Oi. <laughs> says it slightly increases health but slightly decreases happiness. You guys are not allowed to smoke anymore. I will be right back, Jess. No! There's also a pet ban. But I'm not gonna do that because that's mean. They can live without cigarettes. They can't live without pets. So this panel over here on the left shows me pretty much everything about my city. So this traffic button shows me where the congestion is, like all these orange areas. I don't have any red zones, which is good because of the way I planned it in the first place. But the orange zones are the busy part. 
uh, this part right here on the off the freeway is a red zone, reddish zone. Mm -hmm. So there's a lot of traffic in this little tight spot right here. <laughs> but everything else seems to be good. Uh oh, they're asking for power. That tight spot always gets a lot of traffic. Yes, Tover. <laughs> uh, Tover made a joke. <laughs> so I made myself are you guys sad. Asking for power because there's not enough power? Let's see. Yeah, we're not producing enough power. You're not producing enough power, huh? I don't have money for another power plant unless I take another loan. Hmm, how much is the power plant? 19,000. I almost have enough. If I go for too long, though, all those people that need power, they're gonna leave. And then all of their houses are going to be abandoned. See, the electricity panel up here is what tells me how much they're consuming and how much we're making. Hmm. I enjoy this. Okay, I almost have enough, so I'm going to find the spot where I want to put it. The LGR guy was saying he really liked the soundtrack. Your deluxe edition came with it. Okay. You should send that to me, too. I don't know where I would have gotten it from. You would get it from the deluxe edition? No, I mean Or where? do you mean you don't know how to download it? Yeah. Um, it would be in your... I think it downloads it automatically? Or you might have to tell it to download it through your extra content, but if it did download it, it's in your uh, file system under your Steam folder. Why are we not... Oh, I don't have money. That's why. I'm like, why isn't this working? You know what? I'm just so happy to see Donut Man chase down the fire people. That made me happy all by itself. Okay. As along with the mysterious disappearing hot dog man and the dude who pulled into the hamburger places and left immediately. <laughs> we have even more need for residential. Even more. Well, it's a growing city, woman. So... Now I have to figure out if I build this way in the middle of the zone, then I'll be closer to the pollution. But that means they'd also be closer to work. So what I'll probably do is just do a little bit closer, but not too far. Because I don't want to be too close to the pollution and have them complaining about it. Why can't you... No, never mind. It's a stupid question. I take it back. Fine. I'm sure you could do something with it, but I just don't want to ask it. It seems like it's obvious. Okay. It seems like it's obvious that you know what you're doing. I've only played it like three times. Like a pro, Jess. Where's the, uh... I mean, this is your city. Where is the, um... Hmm. The monument to me? No, uh, well. <laughs> that doesn't exist yet. No, I was going to say, where is the, um, oh god, what am I thinking? <sighs> My brain is failing me completely right now. Let's see if I can think of what it is. Oh, cool story, bro. Yeah, where is the Medieval Times restaurant? Um, you know I didn't actually create this city, right? See now, if I want to put this. Who's building it right now? If I want to put this road here, then it'll take down my power lines. Can't you just rebuild them? Yeah, but they're in a perfect line right now. 
I don't want to screw that up. You perfectionist, you. We will go across long ways. Okay. Let's build you bitches some houses. Ho hopefully that'll be enough. Right now I see some abandoned buildings I have to take care of. This one says not enough educated workers. So they're gonna be leaving soon. This place is abandoned. <laughs> Me tired, never. I, I'm completely awake. Just does not keep me up to all hours of the night. This was your idea. Uh, no, this was your idea of get me to not uh, go to Ice Crown. And I like this idea, so... But this was originally your idea. Yeah, and I still enjoy... I told you I'm enjoying it. Uh-huh. What more you want? Not only do the buildings become abandoned, but they start to decay over time. So is that where you're destroying buildings that are abandoned? Yeah. There's a bunch of them complaining that they don't have enough workers. So hopefully now that <laughs> What I are the residential people doing for a living? Now that I have um, more houses, maybe more people will come? So if you destroy them, does it stay as, as an industrial zone that will rebuild itself if it needs to? Yes. Because I didn't, okay. I didn't clear out the zone. If I wanted to clear out the zone, I could. That's cool, then. I like that you don't have to retell them what you want there. Yeah, this is staying a resident. I mean, a industrial zone. It's just, it's just gonna have some empty spots right now. So that's a pain in the ass. I don't know why they thought that was a good idea. Okay, so since I'm almost out of money, I'll go back to unpause. Now they're going to start Freeze magically fire. building houses super da, fast. Da, 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 da. Did you see they have a pet band over? What band? Pet. It says it slightly reduces garbage, but it slightly decreases its happiness. What? What is it? The pet pet ban. pet ban. So I'm not doing that. I'm doing the smoking ban. Oh, pet ban. God, I thought you were saying pet band, and I'm like, what is she talking about? These guys need water. Shaw's gonna draw some stuff today. It is gonna shit's gonna get real. He's gonna draw uh, Shaw crying over Banjo Kazooie and saying, "You're dead, you're dead." And Banjo's like, "Well, I'm still here." And Shaw's like, "No, you're dead." <laughs> this sounds very dramatic. It is. See, this is what I don't like about this: is that just in this little zone, like let's say you were coming from here, you have to stop here, stop here. And then if you're coming here and coming this way, then you stop this way again. I could, I could build a park. Hmm. I build you a park. There you go. Everyone happy now. Everyone happy. Don't worry, be happy. I don't awesome. have enough money for a high school yet, though. So only the elementary school kids are getting an education. And then we send them off into the wild. No, they... When you first build an elementary school, they say, Yay, no more homeschooling. So I'm guessing after elementary school, if there's no high school, that they go back to homeschooling. Damn. Poor kids. Yep. So, since we have more industrial areas, I'm going to tax them more. <laughs> You're supposed to tax them less so they'll want to move to your city. And there'll be too many of them. And then you tax the people a little bit more. Or commercials. 
One of the two. Commercialized areas. What a great city. I would think I'm dreaming if I didn't know otherwise. Oh, Jess, you can tweet about this in real life, too. I think this smoking ban is excellent. For a non-smoking bartender like me, this is great. It's got to be w at least one who's speaking through a voice box. I fucking hate this smoking ban. <laughs> this is bullshit. I'm going to move. Someone does complain about it eventually. So I can look at the electricity. Look at the look at the water. Yes, I know I have a high school I can build. Stop telling me. Oh, I have enough money now. Okay. I that's guess, why they're pestering you. I guess that's why. Like you have the money, come on. Now is this gonna cover enough people? Yeah. All right, we get a high school now. Everybody's happy. Okay. The importance of schooling seems to have reached the local government. I think the smoking ban is excellent. I think the smoking ban is shit. <laughs> Landfill is 29% full. So, it's a big old R. What does the R stand for? Riverside. Good morning, everybody. What a beautiful sunrise. Hashtag paradise on earth. <laughs> Apparently, we still have plenty of room in my schools, but one of the elementary schools is not reaching enough kids, so... I have to build another one when I have the money for it. I almost have enough. Okay. You guys are gonna get an elementary school! Congratulations! If this was Shaw City, all the kids would be put to work in a Swedish salt mine. <laughs> Healthcare. We have no sick citizens. Average health is 76%. I don't have a cemetery yet, so ho glad I'm glad nobody's dying. Happiness. The residents are 68% happy. Commercial is 75% happy. Industrial is 91% happy. They're like, oh, you are taxing the shit out of us. We love it. <laughs> Let the wind. I don't need to know about the wind. I don't have any turbines going on. Pollution! Ooh, look at how polluted this is. Gross. Gross. Grody. Oh, I see a building that's been abandoned. Ooh, three of them. I like how the pollution looks like blood on the map. Yeah. It's amazing. It's pretty cool. Well, it says ground pollution is 34%, but the drinking water is crystal clear. Look at what the polluted water looks like. It's gross. Need to fix it soon. Fire safety. Well, well... Looks like I need to build another fire station. Do I have money for that? No, I don't. I do. You will go right next to the elementary school. Noise pollution. Ooh. Now, with the roads, there are some that have trees lining them. It helps with the noise pollution. 
but I haven't built any of those. Yay, 2,600 people! <laughs> now I can build a transportation system and start recycling like the Swedes. <laughs> Okay. Swedish technology. Bjork into this Fnjorkin. <laughs> Tiffer's so it's offensive. 98% less Tita Pamai. <laughs> what? This car gets 40 heads to the Hoffen. Uh, I can allow recreational use of controlled substances, which will attract more tourists, but it requires more police presence. It will slightly increase my tax income, moderately increase tourism, slightly reduce the crime rate, and increase the police budget. Well, I should hope you're paying the police. <laughs> so we'll do that, and then the recycling says, slightly reduced garbage, slightly reduced tax income. Only slightly? Wow, they're really sticking it to recycling, aren't they? I guess. We're gonna recycle anyways. Just cuz. Anyways, just cuz. Uh -huh. This is the best English I've ever heard you speak. I'm glad you like it. Anyways! Shaw is blatantly ignoring all my offensive stuff, I can tell. He's like, I'm eat my fucking toast and you can kiss my ass. <laughs> I can build a bus station now. Ooh. It has to be along a road, though, so I'm going to build a road just for it. Um, hopefully they don't complain about power. And if you see some little headphones on the icon, that means it's going to cause some noise pollution. Now that I've built the bus station, I need to bank some bus lines. I guess you shouldn't build that dubstep tower, huh? <laughs> so, um, this will tell me once the, the buses start going how many citizens are using it each week and how many tourists are using it each week. And later on, I'll be able to build a railroad, a metro station, a bus station, and an airport. I mean, not a bus station. A dock. And an airport. So, although the bus station costs me money, the bus lines don't cost me any money to make. The last time I made one last night, I, it, it kind of crossed it was terrible so hopefully I'll make a better one this time at least this time it's in the middle of town and when you make a bus line people next to it get happy this will make Shaw upset why? because he likes people to be unhappy what? I was saying earlier, the people were too happy. Ah, uh, yes, that's true. He did ask you to burn down the high school. <laughs> and you can have bus lines on the same, different sides of the street, but uh, they have to go in a path that makes sense. If this was Shaw Town, I can't see the last half of his sentence. I'll, I'll look. Hang on. If this was Shaw Town, every house would have explosives under it, <laughs> and the mayor would just have a big control panel. I think he means plunger. He wants it to be just like Looney Tunes. Jeez. In fact, his seat is on top of the plunger, and if he ever gains five pounds, it goes down and everyone dies. And then they see him inconspicuously visiting the burger place every goddamn day. 
<laughs> so there is my bus line number one. The route goes through the industrial area and the commercial area and then goes back to the bus station. So now I'm going to build another one that goes through the residential area to the bus station. Ooh. And then I'll build a third one, but I really don't need to because this is just for you guys to see, I guess. It's good to be King. Burger King, Shella? Is that copyright infringement? Everybody's getting so happy. There's buses. Look at all these happy people. This yes, also I'm happy. This will also cut down on pollution. <clears throat> Naturally. Yeah. I'm still making these bitches walk to the end of their street. We're not going to mess with those residential streets. Okay, now we have two lines. And now I'll start another one. Why'd you have to get that song in my head for? Which one? Happy. <laughs> Damn it, Dover. Because I'm happy. I don't know the words that well, though. Happy, 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 oh, happy. Did we not stand in the Despicable Me line long enough for you to learn the words to that song? No. We did stand in it for a long time, though. That was a great little ride. Worth every ache, right, Jess? <laughs> Every what? Every ache. Ugh. You were tender after that. Yes, Topher hurt me. No, the ride hurt you. <laughs> I may have hurt you, but I don't think you mentioned it at the time. I was kidding. No, are you serious? I like hurting Jess, though. It's my favorite thing to do. Alright, so now there's three bus lines, so everybody should be happy. Happy, happy, happy. They're all singing and that the song. The mayor has worked tirelessly, and now the regional government has passed the bill that allows for larger city territory. Ooh. Hong Kong, bus is on the way. I'll take the bus to work, please. Let's speed this up a bit. We have a high need for residential. Look at all these buses. They're blue. Blue, dava, dee, da, boo, die. Mm hmm. Recycling is an important step in admitting our impact on nature and the environment. It's telling me that there's a piece of land for me to buy, but I don't. Ain't nobody got time for that. I don't have money. It's good to own land. Why do they think I have money for? I don't have money. Because you are a pillar of the community. Uh-huh. Do you want to live next to the bus station? Me? If, if you were living in my town. Um, no, because that's where all the slime balls uh, coalesce. <laughs> I, I mean, there are good people take the bus, and there's like, dude, I'm taking the bus. You got 50 cents. No, fuck I, those people. I remember. Yes, I remember too. I took it as well. There's some real creeps on those bus too. 
Mm-hmm. My ass has never been so fucking punished before in my entire life. Well, at least it was just your ass that was hurting. Does what else could possibly be hurting? My back. Oh. My neck. I held my bag in my lap the whole way down there. God, that was torture. It was heavy, too. I took a backpack and I had it wrapped around me. Meanwhile, I get on a plane and two hours later, I'm there. Mm -hmm. And it's... <laughs> they probably still have not removed the grip marks from me grabbing the edge of that seat for two hours solid. My knuckles turning white. I can't feel my hands anymore. I fucking hate flying. We are finally recycling. I can't wait to separate all my trash into different piles. Do batteries go with metals? No. Batteries are separate, usually. Well, I know I... you know this. <laughs> I can't tell Dexter this. The custodian in me knows this answer. Mm -hmm. Batteries get recycled differently. Mm -hmm. However, plastics and metals can go together. People don't know that. They sort it at the, the plant or whatever. At least here they do. Why are you telling me that you're out of city limits there? Who drew this line? Why isn't it straight? I guess we're gonna have a curved road here. And uneven squares. <sighs> the OCD part of you is going crazy, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Oh, uh, did she tell you a story, Jess, about my sister? Uh, she was telling me that her boyfriend had made the mistake of telling her our baby was ugly when it was born. And then he says, well, she looks good now, but she was an ugly baby when she was born. Oh, and my sister was super offended. <laughs> she's like, you don't call our baby ugly. Mm -hmm. and she, he's like, oh, she's cute now. And she's like, she's like, I nearly cried and I wanted to kill him. <laughs> I was like, oh, my God, man. Being a woman's complicated. <laughs> <laughs> I think he's trying to get punched. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I said your ba but I told her I was like your baby was cute when she was born. What's his problem? How why why would he say she's ugly? She's just a baby. I've seen some ugly babies, okay? <laughs> but they ain't my kids. I ain't calling my kids ugly. <laughs> he wants to get punched. Yeah, she was mad at him the other day too cuz they had an agreement that they don't really put much stock into getting each other gifts and stuff, but he like literally gets her nothing ever. And so she's like, it'd be nice if every once in a while I get something. Mm -hmm. Yes, Tibbs. Wait for him to get in trouble. He's a, a foolish man! I think I'm giving these houses a bit too much space. Because they're building some big houses. They don't all need to have big houses, do they? <laughs> they can live like rats in their sardines in a sardine can, can't oh, they? I can build a cemetery now. So I'm going to build that over here in the industrial area. Maybe. I don't, ha I don't have the space for it. Okay, you're going to go next to the bus station. Happy hauntings. Okay. So, Jess, we have nicknames for everybody now at the game days. Because we were calling my sister Darth Vader because she gets so into the game. And my brother had an argument with her last week, so we started calling him Darth Sidious. <laughs> I don't know what this means. And then this week, they said I was getting penisy, which I don't believe. I don't think I actually was. So he started calling me the coolest Darth of all, Darth Revan. I'm cool with being Darth Revan. He is the best. What does this mean? This means that you need to watch more Star Wars and play more Knights of the Old Republic. But you said... I said what? 
that Star Trek was better than Star Wars. Yes. I didn't say it was better. I said I liked it better, didn't I? I don't recall exact wording. They each have their separate charm and stuff, but I do prefer Star Trek over Star Wars. Uh-huh. It doesn't mean it's better, necessarily. So why do I have to watch Star Wars, then? Because they're both good! And because you haven't seen them. I watched episode one! I need to watch uh, the new episodes again because I watched them when I was really young and I still think people were extremely unfair to those movies uh, for not having seen any of the other Star Wars I thought episode 1 was fine the only thing is uh, I used to not care about Jar Jar Binks that much but eh, now I do don't like him I do don't like him That's I great do news. don't like him now I don't like him I do don't like him I just don't see his point. He's kind of a stupid character. But if you think about it, all the time honored traditional characters are stupid too. Like, why, why do does Han Solo. Why does Han Solo have a Wookiee who's like. Rawr, 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 all the time? And I can't make the gurgling sound, but. Uh huh. Yoda's. All these intersections. Yoda's, Yoda essentially is an elf. Nobody questions that. <laughs> anyway, yes, I would. If I had to live in either world, I would always choose Star Trek. But Star Wars has an appeal, too. I wouldn't mind living in that world, either. Okay. And whenever you say okay, I know you don't care. <laughs> That's like your signal for I don't give a shit what we're talking what about. What does this have to do with what I said? I have no idea. I forgot what you even said. <laughs> Now, now, Joseph, I'm in the middle of a fucking revelation here! Tover's trying to get in trouble, too. Star Wars and Star Trek. How am I getting in trouble? You don't even know. That's because there's nothing to get in trouble for, woman. You're just making crap up to be funny. That's not true. It I is true. I just destroyed some houses to build a medical clinic. I guess I'll bulldoze this orphanage to make an elementary school. There's no orphanages in this game. I have to give them some water. Jess, why you fight with me in front of the guys? It's so emasculating. <laughs> <laughs> guys, I have to let her win because she's a girl. You know what I mean. Uh-huh. Now I'm trying to get in trouble. Someone wants to get punched. Well, I'm not calling our baby ugly, at least. What baby? Hell, I ain't stupid. Fuck. <laughs> what baby you speak of? Babies? Baby? I mentioned babies. Did you guys hear babies? I think he's losing it again. You said babies. Babies? Mm-hmm. I have never heard of these things before. What are they? You said it. Said what? Babies. I didn't say that word. Okay. You can also set up districts, but I haven't done that yet. That's if you really want to micromanage. Which I'm sure you do. Not particularly. <clears throat> sure, Jess. Fight it now. You know, uh, Jess, according to Chris Hart or Kevin Hart, <laughs> the way to get out of a conversation with you or an argument is to say something random 
slam the door and walk away before you can figure out what the hell I said. Man, I was coming, you cooking with the microwave on high. Slam the door, walk out. <laughs> I saw the commercial for his newest movie and it looked stupid. So? Comedians don't make brilliant movies usually. <clears throat> They're this, meant to be stupid. This is showing me the land value. Clearly, the best part of the town is this teal color area in the middle here. Clearly. I don't have any high uh, val land value places yet. <laughs> I just got an achievement called Well Informed. Because I've been looking at all my inf info panels. <laughs> Good job, Jess. I have 3% unemployment. That's pretty fantastic. How are they unemployed with all these places looking for more people? Some people just don't want to work, you know what I mean? There's 2,400 jobs available. Some people don't want to work. Now I have 2% unemployment. Now I have 2% milk. Damn it. 30... No, 313 citizens took the bus this week and one tourist. <laughs> My best line apparently is highly efficient. Jess, My you know the best part? Low. The best part about Star Wars is designing your lightsaber. What would your lightsaber look like? Why don't you take a stab in the dark? Yours would be rainbow colored and shaped like a unicorn horn. What? Shaw's lightsaber would be cat o' nine tails easily. What? Topher's lightsaber would be a bastard sword. I wouldn't have the guards though. It would not be rainbow and unicorn related. Why not? If you want to design your own lightsaber, why'd you leave it up to me? I thought that you would guess right. Guess right? I didn't think you were going to be wrong. How the hell should I know? Don't you know me? Not well enough to design your lightsaber. You know Shaw. Yeah. yeah. Shaw would be Shaw would be the first lightsaber fucking uh, mace out there with spikes in it or something. I'm glad that high school's covering so much of the map. No. Why is this? It, it wouldn't be overkill, Tibbs. What are you talking about? It'd be like a C tan phase knife from Warhammer or something. Totally OP. But amazing. Alright, Jess, tell me what your lightsaber would be. Uh, what am I supposed to be doing with this lightsaber? Well, it's a weapon. I know. Is it just for looks? Am I killing people with it? Let's say for you it's looks. <laughs> hmm. But keep in mind you could use it to kill people. I think that it would be the same color as my character's eyes and glowy like her eyes. So you have no idea what your lightsaber looked like, but you're mad at me for not knowing what it is. <laughs> I just told you. <laughs> you. You said it was blue in color. It's just a standard lightsaber, then. I don't know. Her eyes aren't blue. Yes, they are. No, they're a shade of blue. They're what? A, a shade of teal. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> you know damn well what I'm talking about. Okay, hey, so your lightsaber... Here. Look at all these people trying to get in. 
Your lightsaber would be a bluish teal color. And that's it. That's all it's fancy about it. It glows, and maybe there's some sparkles or something. Look at all these people trying to get off the freeway. That sucks. Jeez. In two fast. different directions. You know, uh, Jess, usually lightsaber color has to deal with what kind of class you are. I don't know, so, and I don't care. Purple lightsabers are wielded by sentinels. What's a sentinel? It's a mix between a melee class and a f uh, power class. What's a someone power who, class? Someone who uses the force. That's the power class. And then I think blue guys are more melee-ish. I forget what the hell they're called, though. It's been a while since I've played KOTOR. But KOTOR also had an orange lightsaber, and I have no idea what the hell that was about. Shaw has nothing to say about the lightsabers. Shaw's not paying attention, I'm sure. He's got like eight windows up and he's complaining to his biggest fans about something. I don't know what. How could he not listen to you talk about lightsabers? He's eating his toast. That doesn't take that long. Toast is life! Life is toast. Well, apparently we're in high demand for residential again. Your city's gonna be nothing but residential. Apparently. Why is the ground all purple? Because of pollution? No. What is it I then? I was on a spe special screen for something, I don't remember. Oh, okay. I'm not on it anymore. I was looking at something. Purple. Okay, Jess, you've watched Star Trek. So if you could be any race in Star Trek, what it would be? I don't know they're different races. You know Vulcans, you know Klingons. The Klingons are bad. It depends on the way you look at it. So you'd obviously be the human race because you see everything as a human. Klingon's bad, Vulcan's good, Romulan's not so sure. <laughs> well, the only Romulan they showed was trying to kill them. Yes. That doesn't mean they all do it. Okay. I would have to be the Ferengi. What in the world is that? It is a large-eared trading race who love to swindle people. They have like 258 merchant values or something like that, and they force all their women to be naked at all times. They consider it an insult for them to be clothed. I think that's hilarious, because I'm a chauvinist. <laughs> Obviously, I'm going to be in trouble for the rest of the day. Okay. You could be a Borg, Jess. A what? A Borg. They just want to assimilate everyone into their collective consciousness. You know, think like me, I make you. <laughs> but you can be whatever race you want, they'll take you over. So Tibbs, instead of uh, selecting a race, has selected a character he'd want to be. Data who can please a woman in over 2,000 different ways, or whatever it was. What? <laughs> Actually covered in the show, I'm not making that up. What? Why was this mentioned in the show? Because there's a part where everyone uh, goes insane for some reason. I don't remember, it's been so long since I've seen it, but... uh. Data gets seduced by the security officer? I forget her name now. She's the blonde that wasn't on there for long. Got replaced by Worf, who was like a million times better. But she's talking to him. He's like, I am proficient in pleasing in over 2,000 forms of pleasure or something like that. Uh-oh, what did I just delete? If I could be any character, I would be the oversexed and misguided Riker. 
<laughs> what does this mean? I don't know. What What do you mean? What you're talking about? I don't know. You don't know what you're even talking about? It's because I don't know what you're asking me, woman. I'm asking you what you're talking about. Talking about which character I would be. And obviously it'd be Riker. Robot invasion eminent. Check for more clues and applause in near you. Hashtag flash mob. It's bad you can't like zoom and see that. Nobody's there. I think you're getting into this too much. You're not tired of it yet. <laughs> Look at that rickety old house next to that park. They're still piling onto your off onto your off ramp. Did you see that? How is there no power, people? There. Have some power. Oh, I need to make another power station. Uh oh. <clears throat> That's not good. Do those power lines you put in not connect to anything? Yeah, they are. Jeez, Topher. Hmm? Jeez. Jeez what? Jeez. I don't know what you're cheesing about. Well, I could improve my, um, or upgrade my road here and destroy some things. Let's do that. Upgrade road. Let's upgrade this one to... Well, it is a four lane, so I can make it a six lane. It's really weird, because the problem seems to be the onflow, not the actual city itself. Well, it's because there's too many intersections here. They need more flow and less stop. I thought you said this would destroy uh, things adjacent to it. Well, sometimes it does. It depends. Because I, I made this as a four lane before. This, apparently the four lane and the six lane don't have too much of a size difference, but the one... They just take out the median, looks like. Yeah. Okay, let's see if this helps. The only other way I can think of is to stop traffic right here, which I think I might do. Make people go around. That might upset some people. Oh well. <laughs> That's the spirit. But I can build a walking path. So if people want to um walk through here, then they can. Now there's a walking path. Just don't care who she upsets. She's the mayor. She makes the rules. This is my town. That's right. So is it alleviating the build back up or whatever? It looks like they're kind of moving faster now. 
Oh, there's one last part they have to stop for. Um, one last car or bus or whatever. Well, you can see him actually getting backed up all the way in the highway, too. Yeah, they're pretty backed up. I'm gonna zoom out a little bit so you guys can see it. This is like trying to get into LA. <laughs> I know! <laughs> <laughs> You remember Topher when we were going to Disneyland. Yes, yeah, so I'm so glad I wasn't driving. <laughs> it still didn't seem as bad as Seattle, though. Well, that's because there's no roundabouts. There's no one-way streets, either. Well, there are some one-way streets, but I don't think we happened to buy any of them. Okay, I can't... I, it looks like it helped, but I can't sit here and look at it any further. I gotta see what these guys are complaining about. More residential? Really? Really? What is your guys' problem? They need more places to live? Why? Why do they want to live in the city? Jess, I am super tired. Okay, just a few more minutes, Topher. You can stay on if you want. I'm gonna go to bed, though. <laughs> no, a few more minutes. <laughs> Woman? Let me finish building this road, at least. You could do whatever you want. I don't want you to leave yet, Topher. Don't leave. Sing that pink song to me. Please don't leave me. <laughs> I always say how I don't need you. But it's always gonna come right down to this. Please, baby, I'm desperate. So I mean... <laughs> you can save these on the cloud. Wait, yeah. The cloud so that you can play it on any computer that has this game that's cool so yeah. march the city of march I just march 15 date. march 15 it 2015. saves super fast too okay that's it for the stream oh now i feel bad like everyone's like oh tofer ended he's a jerk <laughs> No, it's okay. I want I want to stop streaming anyways. I need to get up and stuff. Thanks for watching. Okay. It's a good show.